Hello and welcome to part 6 of the lecture series. In this video, you will learn how to find number of non-negative integer solutions of equation 5x1 plus x2 plus x3 plus x4 is equal to 14. I will explain two approaches to solve this problem. Before solving this problem, I will recommend you to watch and understand concepts mentioned in part 1 and part 2 of the lecture series. To view those videos on YouTube, just search number of non-negative integer solutions for part 1 and number of positive integer solutions for part 2. The link of both videos has been given in the description below. Up till now, we know how to find number of non-negative or positive integer solutions of linear equations with unit coefficients. But what will happen when one of the coefficient is not unity? Let's say when coefficient of x1 is 5 and each coefficient of x2, x3 and x4 is 1. But believe me, it is not too difficult. Allow me to ask a question. What will be the possible values of x1 in equation 1 given it is a non-negative integer? That's correct. The only possible values of x1 are 0 or 1 or 2. Because if x1 is greater than or equal to 3, the sum of all variables on left hand side would be greater than 15. Even if x2, x3, x4 are kept minimum to 0. Let us rewrite equation 1 in the form of equation 2, where x1 is either 0 or 1 or 2. If x1 equals 0, x2 plus x3 plus x4 equals 14. If x1 equals 1, x2 plus x3 plus x4 equals 9. If x1 equals 2, then x2 plus x3 plus x4 equals 4. According to Addison principle of counting, Sum of number of non-negative integer solutions of these three linear equations is equal to number of non-negative integer solution of equation 1. When x2 plus x3 plus x4 equals 14, the number of solutions equals 16 factorial divided by product of 14 factorial and 2 factorial. When x2 plus x3 plus x4 equals 9, the number of solutions equals 11 factorial divided by product of 9 factorial and 2 factorial. And when x2 plus x3 plus x4 equals 4, the number of solutions equals 6 factorial divided by product of 4 factorial and 2 factorial. Adding these values, we get 190. Hence, the total number of non-negative integer solutions of equation 1 equals 190. We can solve this problem using second approach called blue and yellow ball method. Please note that Number of blue colored balls equals number on right hand side that is 14 minus 5x1 and number of yellow colored balls equals number of positive sign on left hand side that is 2. So the total number of ways of arranging 16 minus 5x1 balls in which 14 minus 5x1 are of one kind and 2 are of second kind is equal to 16 minus 5x1 factorial divided by product of 14 minus 5 x1 factorial and 2 factorial. Definitely we will calculate summation here, where lower limit of x1 is 0 and upper limit is 2. This time also we get the same result, which equals 190. In the next part of the series, we will learn how to find number of non-negative integer solutions of linear equation 3 x1 plus 5 x2 plus x3 plus x4 equals 10. If you find content of this video useful, consider subscribing this channel. See you in the next video. Thanks for watching.